there's a few uh, red lines um, that are going through this exhibition on different layers. Um, there's a strong connection of the three works in the upper floor, um, American Night, The Swap and Unknown Soldier, all of them dealing with the cult of weapon and violence in the US. So American Night is the attempt to uh, connect the grounding myth of America, the myth of the frontier. Um, I found uh, recurrent motives that are, that are in every Western. And so American Night is based on five of these elements that can't miss in the Western. It's the long, lonely cowboy, um, the deserted village, the campfire scene, the saloon, and the waiting woman. These five scenes are almost in every Western that you will have ever seen. So in, in, in my piece, um, each of the screens, uh, each of these uh, elements has its own screen, but there's something strange going on. The lonely cowboy on the left screen, uh, for instance, is uh, not at all a cool cowboy. He's not a Marlboro cowboy or a Richard Prince cowboy. He's more a very romantic Caspar David Friedrich uh, cowboy, overwhelmed by the sublime landscape and not really knowing what to do with himself and at the end he even arrives at the ocean which is um, a taboo in the western because it doesn't fulfill the, the uh, cliché of the frontier storytelling although it's funny because California has an entire Pacific coast but this, the ocean never shows up in western so there's all these kind of breaks with, uh, with the normal narrative of, of western uh, storytelling. Mm -hmm.